when I was in ninth grade, I completely had no idea what I wanted to be. But um, now that actually being in Build, I kind of found a passion for, for business. And every year, they taught us something that excited me even more. Now being in this program and having this be my third year, I think I finally know what I want to be now, which is an entrepreneur or a CEO of my own company. Students work in teams to write a business plan every day in their E1 classroom. In their sophomore year of high school, build students into the largest youth business incubator in the country. There they implement their businesses. In their sophomore year, students work on manufacturing, financing, selling, and product design. And for academics, they work on academic coaching and tutoring. Build's target student comes from a low-income family, is first generation in their family to go to college, and is highly disengaged from academics. The typical Build student is the student you see in the back of the classroom. I could just see a lack of, um, um, a lack of enthusiasm, but after the first showcase and leading up to the first showcase, I noticed that uh, they ramped up the intensity a lot. So I saw them get involved and I think it's that whole my business type of thing. This is my business. This is my presentation. I'm also an entrepreneur at heart and I know what that entrepreneur bug can do. They're doing PowerPoint projects. They're doing 10 page um, business written plans. I mean, they're only ninth grade. This is the first time they've ever done those things and they're not even realizing that they're doing work. All they know is that they're working on their own business. Suzanne McKechnie Clark founded Build with four students and a $30,000 budget. Today, Build is a national program that serves almost 1,000 students across the country and continues to grow. For the past 10 years, Build has been focused on college access. And what that means is Build has been about getting kids into college, accepted to college. And Build was extraordinarily, has been extraordinarily successful at doing that. Last year, 100% of Build graduates got into a four-year institution. Now, Build is taking on a much more serious challenge. Build is now about getting kids to graduate from college. And the research shows us when kids graduate from college, the cycle of poverty is highly likely to be broken, not just for that kid, but for their children and their children's children. So Build has embarked on a challenge that I don't think anybody else in the country is taking on.